everybody, this is a Learning 3GS screencast. In this screencast is about one 3x a day challenge. In this challenge, I have to produce one game extension for 3GS every day on that for two months. We will see how it goes. Today, we are talking about an easy way to include transparency in your 3GS game. And we're going to talk so about 3x transparency. Let me show that to you. Where is the link? Here. So transparency may seem trivial like that, but that's not at all when you are doing WebGL. And this is trouble when you are starting with WebGL. So this is an easy way to handle it, applying usual algorithm. You don't have to know them. <laughs> OK. So 3x transparency to easily handle the transparency, look at it, play with it. I don't know, do glass in your game or do stuff like that, stuff that need transparency. See ya, people. And don't forget our motto. Once 3x a day, get your game on.